Hi, my name is Z, and I canvassed with the Georgia Cumberland Conference, and this is my story. So, you know, it's been a long day of canvassing. You know, it's a little hot, the hottest day ever. And, um, you know, I've gotten like, you know, three books, so, and I'm like, at this rate, I'm never gonna get books. Cause I was going up hills, um, and you know, their driveways were like this, and I like walked all the way up, and they were like, no. And I had to walk all the way back down, and it just felt like I was not getting anywhere. So I, you know, I prayed, and I was just like, Lord, teach me to have faith. You know, teach me to endure in hard trials. So I rang on this one door, and this um, lady came out, and she was like, "Hi, how are you?" And I'm like, "I'm good," because no one has ever asked me how was my day today. So I was like, "I'm good," you know, it's a little hot. And she was like, "Yeah, um, do you need water? Do you need anything?" And I'm like. Oh, I'm good. So then I canvassed her, and she was like, you are an answer to prayer. Because I've been struggling with my Christianity. I've been struggling with if God was real or not. And I told him, just give me a sign. And I fear that this is it. And I was like, okay. And so she's like, I want to know more about him. And I was like, okay, then I'll give you, they call him Jesus, his desires, ages. And I gave her all the devotion books I had. She was like, this is amazing. I think what you're doing is um, very nice because people like me are just looking for it. But I cannot find it anywhere because I'm not finding the books I need. And so she was like, and also she looked at finding these food because it's teaching like nutrients and like all of that stuff through healthy foods and not medicine. And she was like, yeah, I've just been taking medicine on pills and pills and I've been looking for a different approach and I feel like this is it. So she was like, um, keep on doing what you're doing, you know, and she was like, you know, um, can I pray for you, and she said a prayer for me, and this taught me just how amazing God is, and how even if it feels like he's not there, he always is.